The latest crime in Germantown has left a sour taste in Andrea Riegling's mouth. I saw our fellow small business owner, Four Pegs, their food truck uh, was stolen, and I thought, why don't we unify and come together? The truck was recovered, but it prompted this longtime resident to look into starting a neighborhood watch group, not for business owners, but for everyone who calls Germantown home. I think people are ready to come together and to know more of your neighbors and to see what's going on and, and protect our community. This crime, just one of several LMPD is looking into in Germantown. Within the past week, a woman says two of her dogs died after eating an orange substance believed to be poison that was found in her backyard. I know there's been some graffiti, there's been some vandalism. We did, unfortunately, earlier this summer had some issues down at Kroger. District 10 Council Member Pat Mulvihill says the surge of crime has those living in the area wanting to do their part to prevent future ones from happening. I think the more eyes that you have, whether it be uh, artificial eyes or human eyes, is, can only help and help police solve issues and help neighbors deal with things that are unpleasant. Whether this neighborhood group deters or slows down crime will remain to be seen. But Riegling says it's better than doing nothing. If we know what's going on and we keep our eyes out together and we talk, like I said, factually based, and we come together with those resources, I think it will help us in the long run.